The anointing that has begun to be released onto these clouds is for that of prisoners to be released. For I hear God saying that even was as Jeremiah was thrown into the dungeon and became imprisoned even by that situation, the Lord says there are some of you that are connected to those that are imprisoned right now. And the Lord says even as you would sow into this anointing, the Lord says, and you would receive of this fabric and you would take it even to their prison cell. The Lord says that you would begin to see the miracles that would take place. Oh, for even as the rotten rags were let down to pull Jeremiah out of his situation, even so the Lord says that these rags shall pull that one out of their situation. Oh, for even as the rags seemed as though they were rotten and insignificant, but they did a mighty job. Even so, God said there are some that seem to be rotting even in those cells. And man look upon them and they seem as though they're insignificant. But God said, I dare you to believe and trust today, to reach out by faith, attach faith to your seed. And as you receive of this cloth, I, the Lord thy God, shall move on thy behalf, and you shall come back with a mighty testimony, even in the house of the Lord. And so shall it be by the word of the Lord. that great wonders will begin to happen to those that have situation where you're aliens without proper legalization. I see the hand of God moving and changing even things that were denied you. There's one person, I'm looking at number three, like three months ago you got a bad report. I hear the word of the Lord says, your lawyer shall come again. And you should begin to sign the document for legalization. Oh, for I hear the Lord says, these cloths shall begin to go across the waters. For I've seen churches, even in Caribbean islands, where they shall begin to write and call and say, I want a piece of the cloth. Out of a sense of skepticism, but when the cloth shall arrive in the mail, it shall bring a miracle when they open the envelope. The glory will proceed out of the envelope in their faces, and the glory of the Lord shall light them up. Oh, I see the hand of God, even moving even in situations that even in the state of Arkansas, there's a pastor that is watching this program right now. And I see, I see the hand of God moving upon his life because he has reached a point of when he wanted to quit ministry. But the Lord says, as you begin to write and to write in for your, uh, your, your, por your portion in this anointing, the Lord says... Watch the turnaround in that ministry. And I will begin to raise up this, that ministry, this ministry of reconciliation, even in that state, says the Spirit of the living God. For have I not called you and raised you up to deal with the areas of issues of racism and the areas of discriminations that have been set in that place in all kind of secret orders? But the Lord says, I do come and visit that state, says the Spirit of the living God. But I hear the Lord saying this day that there's churches after churches that will begin to come forth out of their coldness the fire of God through the anointed cloth is coming in to help dispel the icicles and cause a new warmth to come in that place a new anointing and the fervency of the of, of worship shall come again ah the anointed cloth the healing and the miracles I see limbs growing out mm, limbs are growing out ah somebody cut out a part of their body because it was bothering them and it's, you thought you could never have family. You could not reproduce, but the Lord says, put the cloth in the secret place and I will show you a miracle. Signs and wonders are being performed. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. I'm looking at the man with a cooperation. Your cooperation is about to between, I'm looking at number five, it's almost as if it is five years old and you're in the middle of a great financial dilemma. But I hear the word of the Lord to you saying, begin to sow the seed and send for your portion of the anointing. And God says, watch me turn around because I'm gonna become wisdom in you and I'll become the money you need and you're gonna see yourself beyond that level that you needed to see to bring you out, out of the dilemma. Out of the dilemma you shall come, says the spirit of the living God. Oh, foolish act. 
Oh, what a foolish act such as this, some may say and some may think. But I hear the Lord saying that you will see great miracles being wrought even through this cloth, says the Spirit of the Lord. Oh, foolish act, foolish act. But these are the things in which I take delight in, says the Spirit of God. Watch and see the miracles that will take place even financially, even for some of you, within the next 48 hours, says the Spirit of God. I see the angel of the Lord coming into the houses of many of you as a result of having this garment in your homes. Watch and see the things I will do, even in the midst of your family members, says God. All things that you thought were impossible, that you might have thought might have been impossible for me to do. Watch and see what a foolish act, such as a piece of cloth being placed on an item or on a particular individual. Watch and see the great work and miracles that I will perform, says God. Oh, prosperity, prosperity, prosperity. Prosperity, 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 says the angel of the Lord. And even in this cloth, you will find much wealth, says the Spirit of God. And the Lord says that many of you who have received the report that your HIV positive and you're in despair saying I'm going to count the days when I'm going to depart this place God says as you take this cloth and pin it on your garment you're going to see in 40 days your health coming back you're going to see the doctor's going to be confounded to know when you said, when, when this thing, the yoke of this disease will break off your life. For God said, new life I'm giving unto you. New life, even your bloodstream. For I, the Lord of God, have already healed you, said the Lord. And I'm bringing you out. Yea, I'm bringing you out. Many of you wanted a point of contact, said the Lord. And as you pin this on your garment, said the Lord. You will be buying your deliverance. You'll be buying your healing. And you will testify of the change. I'm seeing the, 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 the molecular structure in your body begin to take shape. I'm seeing the atoms receiving new life and new strength, even as you pin it on. For God said, this is a day of change. This is a day of liberation. For I'm doing a new thing in this house. I'm visiting you like I visit the prophets of old. I'm causing the miracles to begin again to operate in this place, in the earth. And ye, this house shall be known as a house of miracles, for they shall come from far and wide. And even celebrities, even one in even television should come or will come and receive a miracle, said the Lord. And ye, your name will be noise abroad. It will be a common thing for Zoe Ministries. The name and the lines, they are lining up. For this is the season of miracles, said the Lord. For you have crossed over into another realm, the realm of miracles. Authentic, substantial miracles. And God says, many lives will be changed. Many bodies will be delivered and healed. And finances, even in those that have your own business you're going to see a turnaround in 50 days God says as you sow into this 50 days there'll be a turnaround in your businesses said the Lord of hosts and even as there are many many parents that are worried for their rebellious children children that are on drugs children that are living illicit lives children that are, uh, are walking contrary to God's will and your prayers and your tears and your groaning have been going up to God. This will be your answer. For as you use this cloth, even to pin it, even to put it in their beds, under their mattress, under their pillow, or in some way, while you're praying for them, just hold it up before God. 
this will be your point of contact and God will